There are many sites in the modern world which are overlooked by mainstream academia, some due to their inexplicable nature, and others due to the controversial nature of the discoveries made during initial investigations. One such site is known as the Dover Mound, a large earthwork located in the state of Kentucky, a site which researchers have attributed to Native Americans. Now largely believed to have been a burial ground, this due to the 50 or so cremations which have been identified within the mound. Specifically attributed to a group known as the Adena people, however, one skeleton in particular located at the site escapes modern understanding. A seven-foot-tall giant skeleton of what is claimed as an Adena man was discovered. What was more interesting than his height, however, was his abnormally elongated head and disproportionately large torso in relation to his legs. This is not a unique find, however. Native American burial sites all over America have produced similar remains, yet their origins lack any logical explanation. In Ohio, for example, similar remains were found of incredibly tall men with elongated heads and disproportionately large torsos. The remains were thought to have been of extraterrestrial, but scientific investigation claims to have confirmed these are definitely human remains. Archaeologists are still continuing to find similar remains at Native American burial mounds all over the country, and indeed globally, so the possibility that these remains are instead the remnants of a once global, now lost civilization is still a topic of debate, one which has compelling supporting arguments. One additional site in particular was found in New York. An archaeological dig made in 1971 at a Native American burial ground unearthed more than 200 giant skeletons, some of which measured 9 feet in height. It was estimated at the time that the remains could have been up to 9,000 years old. Yet, predictably, the remains, although widely reported in the media, have subsequently vanished. Were these remains left by a now lost, yet once global civilization? We find their discovery all over the states, and indeed worldwide, highly compelling. <laughs>